I sold my grandmother for 5,000 chrono crystals to Toshi. But in the end, I still got shafted. Now I don't have the new Namiku, neither my grandmother. I don't know what's worse. But the thought of selling my little brother to Toshi is getting bigger and bigger. Later. Toshi made me sell my little brother in the black market. Hello, my name is Pessy, and I am one of many victims that got shafted in Dragon Ball Legends. After selling my grandmother to Toshi for 5,000 chrono crystals, I got shafted, and he offered me a new deal for my little brother. He gave me a total of 20,000 chrono crystals. I couldn't say no to that. I don't think anyone could, right? So after selling my brother, I summoned on the new unit, and I got him twice, eh? I regret nothing, but my father's already searching for him, and I have to find an excuse. I stole my mother's credit card to buy Chrono Crystals. Hello, my name is Pessy. You probably know me already. My parents are still searching for my brother, which I sold in the black market. But I don't care. All I can think of is getting more and more Chrono Crystals. I can't stop but steal the credit card of my mom to buy them. My parents haven't found out yet, but the card says there is no money left. I spent just 3,587, so I'm sure it's a mistake. I have to find new ways to buy Chrono Crystals. My mom was worth 15,000 Chrono Crystals. Hey, it's me Pessy again. Yesterday evening my mom found out about me spending all the money with her credit card. I tried to convince her that I am not addicted, which I am not, otherwise I would have noticed. I begged her not to tell dad about this, but she wasn't listening. At the end I had to get rid of her and Toshi made a great proposal. A total of 15,000 Chrono Crystals for my mom. The person who loves me the most in the world. But who can say no to 15,000? I accepted the deal now. I'm only left with father and 15,000 chronos. <laughs> I regret nothing. I sold our house to summon on the new banner. Hello, my name is Pessy. You know me, I guess. Today is a great day. I got a new offer from Toshi. If I sell our house, I will get 50,000 chrono crystals. <laughs> but my father seems suspicious lately, especially after my little brother and mom. I hope he didn't find out about the black market. Anyways, I'm 50,000 chrono crystals richer now, hey? My father abandoned me because of Dragon Ball Legends. Hello, Pessy here. I could really need help. After I sold our house to get more chronos, we became homeless. My father got to know all the stuff I did and at first screamed at me, beat, and hurt me. I told him that I got the new unit, and that it was worth it, but he didn't want to listen. He started to cry and told me that he hates me, and that he regrets creating me. But all I did is pursuing my dream of becoming the best D-Bell player. Later on he abandoned me, and now I'm alone, all alone, on the streets. And the worst out of all is, that I don't have internet to complete my daily missions. I have to find some free Wi-Fi fast. I sold my kidney to survive. Hello there. These few days weren't easy for me. The street isn't easy to be all alone. But luckily I got some free Wi-Fi from the coffee shop nearby so my daily stamp rally didn't reset. Also, I met a guy who offered me money for my kidney. I have two anyways so I didn't even think of it and sold it for some money. I obviously used the money to full star the new unit and bought a small tent to sleep at night. My next goal is to reach top 10 in PvP rankings and become a professional Dibiligens player. I'm about to die because of Dragon Ball Legends. Hello, long time not heard. As you know, I'm Pessy and I have sold my kidney a week ago. Right now, I'm in the hospital and very sick. I play DB Legends PvP then and there, but I lose way too often even though I have maxed out all my main characters. It's just that I can't fully control my hands anymore. I have no one to pay for the hospital bills, and my father abandoned me. I'm so sorry. Mom. Brother. Father. I regret everything. Please. Please. If this reaches any one of you, help me. I will try to fix everything I did. I'm so sorry.
Hello, here's Pessa's father. I'm so sorry, everything, everything is my fault. I hate everything my son has done to our family, but I still shouldn't have left him alone in the streets. I should have been there for him. I shouldn't have allowed him to play that game called Dragon Ball Legends. <laughs> it destroyed not just Pessa's life, but the life of each of us. And now, now he's gone. I will forever love and miss you, my son was the story of Pessy, and how a simple game destroyed his life. What does this story teach us, guys?